Thank you for watching this week's Pave Tool Tip of the Week. My name is Phil Baylor, and this week we're going to talk to you about a job, a job that we did three, a little over three years ago, using our hybrid edging. And we're going to see just how well that performed. But before we get started, make sure to subscribe to us on YouTube, click the notifications bell below, and that will give you all the latest and greatest videos and updates on what Pave Tool is up to. You can also give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Check us out on Instagram, Facebook. Also go to pavetool.com and it's there you can sign up for the tip of the week. Thank you for watching. Give you just a little bit of history about this job. So this job we did about 25 years ago uh, for a homeowner and we did a backyard patio and all kinds of uh, landscape and whatnot. Since then, new owners purchased it. A new design was made. The pavers were getting kind of old and ratty. So we took everything up redesigned and what happened was the pavers were then turned over and used opposite because the the surface of the existing pavers were so old that this really gave it just a nice neat clean look and this was an opportunity for us to use our hybrid edging on and uh, this is an open grade base system so we used the v-shaped stakes and we used the combination we used our new hybrid edging in aluminum and we also used some plastic edging so we could see a comparison as to how these two uh, edge restraints perform. And so coming up to the job, looking at it, super thrilled. Nothing's really moved that we can see. The visual eye um, is held up really, really well. So we're excited about that. This is extremely wet. We have a large slope uh, in front of me here that comes down, a lot of water comes running down off of here. So and again, moisture a lot of times in three, freeze thaw cycle, that's when we see the edging uplifting and moving where well, we haven't seen any of that here on this job site. So to me, that's a great sign. This is an extreme kind of a, a case just due to all the water and moisture. You can see some of the, the moisture in the joints and the mold and whatnot. So definitely a wet job. So we're, we're thrilled with the outcome of that. I just want to point out on this job, open grade base, so we're using clean stone, not susceptible to freeze saw cycles. And you can see that behind the stairs, this is an area, obviously, we filled probably uh, three, four feet of clean stone in that area, and yet you have no settlement. So make sure on your step areas and where you're doing raised elevations, great opportunity to use the clean stone, and yet now we do. We have that solution for our edging using our hybrid stake with our aluminum edging to prevent that lateral shift. So on this particular job, it was a great chance for us to really test our edging. We have outside curves. We have inside curves, we have inside 90, we have outside 90s. All this we were able to test on the job site and really to see how easy it is really to snip and bend our edging to perform in all these different curves and corners. We appreciate you watching this video. Just a reminder, subscribe to us on YouTube, click the notifications bell to be able to get our latest and greatest videos. Make sure you give us a thumbs up if you did like this video. You can also see us on Instagram, Facebook, and make sure you go to pavetool.com for all our tip of the weeks.